solve y double dash minus 3 y dash plus 2 y equal to 1. Given that y of 0 equal to 0, y dash of 0 equal to 1 by using Laplace transform method. So we have to solve this differential equation using Laplace transform method. Okay. To, to use Laplace transform method, we need the formula. The formulas are, this is the formula, L of y of t equal to y bar, L of y dash of t equal to s y bar minus y of 0, L of y double dash of t is equal to s square y bar minus s y of 0 minus y dash of 0. And another last special formula, L of integral 0 to t y of t dt equal to 1 by s y bar, where y bar is equal to L of y of t. Okay, so this is a formula we have to apply in this problem. Okay, now the given differential equation is y double dash minus 3 y dash plus 2 y equal to 0. Okay, here they are given dependent variable y. But here they are not mentioning the independent variable. So, in this Laplace transform, the independent variables are t, always t. So, here independent variable is t means every function differential equation we can write in the form of y double dash of t minus 3 y dash of t plus 2 y of t is equal to 1. So now to solve this differential equation, I want to apply Laplace transform method. So that I am going to take Laplace transform on both sides. So taking Laplace transform on both sides. Both sides. Okay, so L of y double dash of t minus 3 into L of y dash of t plus 2 into L of y of t is equal to L of 1. That is, I am taking Laplace transform in each and each and every term. L of this minus 3 into L of this plus 2 into L of this equal to L of 1. Okay, now already we, we know the formula for L of y double dash, L of y dash and L of y, y of t. So now I am going to apply these formulas. What are the formula? First formula, L of y double dash of t. Already we discussed the formulas. The formula is S square y bar minus S y of 0 minus y dash of 0. So this is the formula for L of y double dash of t. And then next minus 3 into L of y L of y dash of t. The next formula S y bar minus y of 0. So this is the formula for L of y dash of t. Plus 2 into L of y of t. This is the first formula. L of y of t is y, of t is y bar is equal to L of 1. So this is the Laplace transform formula for a constant. So L of 1 is 1 by s. Okay, now after this I am going to substitute the condition. Initial condition is y of 0 equal to 0 and y dash of 0 is equal to 1. So these two values I am going to substitute here. You see y of 0 value is 0 so that it is 0. y dash of 0 value is 1 so it is 1. So substituting the condition put y of 0 equal to 0 and y dash of 0 equal to 1 in above. So that s square y bar minus y of 0 is 0 minus y dash of 0 is 1 minus 3 into s y bar minus y of 0 is 0 plus 2 y bar is equal to 1 by s. And then after this I want to collect the y bar terms in the left hand side. Other terms can take into right hand side. So what are the y bar terms? So now you see, remove the brackets. S square y bar. This is minus 1. Minus 3s y bar. Plus 2 y bar. Equal to 1 by s. So this is only the term not having y bar. So that I am going to take into right hand side. So all other terms are having y bar. So take commonly y bar outside. So that s square minus 3s plus 2 
into y bar that is here and here here take y bar outside this one can take that side so 1 by s plus 1 after this this can be written as 1 plus s divided by s take this yes 1 1 plus s divided by s and now this term can take into left and right hand side so y bar is equal to 1 plus s divided by s into s square minus 3s plus 2 this in the left hand side term in product form take into this side multiple divided form now this is y bar okay and now next what is y bar you see already the we have we know y bar is equal to l of y of t so that i am going to substitute the value for y bar y bar is l of y of t so that i am going to substitute y bar y bar value is l of y of t is equal to 1 plus s divided by s into the denominator term can be factorized the factorization is s square minus 3s plus 2 2 can be written as 1 into 2 2 so minus 1 minus 1 minus 3 so that the factorization of this is s minus 1 into s minus 2 so this is the factorization and now you see the differential equation whose solution is always y of t so in this differential equation problem we have to find out y bar y of t value to find y of t take this l in the right hand side so that this can be written as y of t is equal to that means that is the solution the solution is l inverse of this 1 plus s by s into s minus 1 into s minus 2 so that to complete the solution i want to find out the l inverse of this so that i am going to take equation number 1 so to find the solution of this i want to find out inverse laplace transform of this by using partial fraction method so now i am going to apply partial fraction method so what is partial fraction method so take the inner term this is 1 plus s by s into s minus 1 into s minus 2 is equal to by the partial fraction method this is a by s plus b by s minus 1 plus c by s minus 2 okay now to apply partial fraction this is 1 plus s by s into s minus 1 into s minus 2 is equal to take the lcm s into s minus 1 into s minus 2 so when the, what the, the lcm of this is the so a is the having only s so what are the remaining term s minus 1 s minus 2 so s minus 1 into s minus 2 plus b by b term what is the denominator of b s minus 1 so what are the remaining term s into s minus 2 so s into s minus 2 plus c into what is the denominator of s c s minus 2 what are the remaining term s into s minus 1 s into s minus 1 so cancel this so now 1 plus s is equal to a into s minus 1 s minus 2 plus b into s into s minus 2 plus c into s into s minus 1 ok now to find the values of a b c i want to substitute value for s so randomly i am going to put s is equal to 1 because when you put s equal to 1 the term will be eliminated then we can find b value ok so by putting s equal to 1 in the above equation 1 plus 1 is 2 is equal to when you put s equal to 1 1 minus 1 0 0 into anything 0 so it can be eliminated 0 plus when you put s equal to 1 so b into 1 into minus 1 when you put 1 is 1 minus 2 minus 1 plus when you put 1 here 1 minus 1 0 0 into anything 0 so which implies that this is minus b so minus b equal to 2 therefore b equal to minus 2 so this is the value for b okay now to find another value i am going to substitute s value is equal to 2 by putting s equal to 2 we can find another constant so put s is equal to 2 
so by putting s is equal to 2 here 2 plus 1 is 3 so by putting s equal to 2 2 minus 2 0 0 into anything 0 when you put s equal to 2 2 minus 2 0 0 into anything is 0 plus c into put s equal to 2 and put s equal to 2 2 minus 1 1 which implies that this is 2c 2c equal to 3 therefore 3 c is equal to 3 by 2 3 divided by 2 therefore c value is 3 by 2 and now to find another constant a i am going to put s is equal to you see 1 okay 2 also okay now s is independently independent term so put when you put s equal to 0 it will be eliminated so that i am going to put s equal to 0 by putting s equal to 0 0 plus 1 1 when you substitute s equal to 0 here, 0 minus 1 minus 1, 0 minus 2 minus 2 and by putting s equal to 0, 0 into anything 0, by putting s equal to 0, 0 into anything 0, so finally a value is minus 2 into minus 1 plus 2 can take here, 2 can take here, so a equal to 1 by 2. So now here a value is 1 by 2. So after obtaining the, all the constant value, we can substitute in this equation. You can take this is equation number 2. So substituting all the constants in the equation number 2, but this equation 2 is equivalent to this. This value can be substituted in the first equation. Okay. So next uh, for the simplification we will see. So after substituting all the values of a, b, c in the second equation, you will be getting like this. Okay, now again this value I am going to substitute in the first equation because the first equation is this is the first equation. So this is inner value, the inner value is this is. Okay, so first equation can be rewrite as that is first equation implies y of t is equal to L inverse of this. This is equivalent to this. Therefore, 1 by 2 by s this is minus 2 by s minus 1 plus 3 by 2 by s minus 2. So after substituting the values in the equation number 1, you are getting like this. Okay, now after this, take a constant 1 by 2 outside. This is L inverse of 1 by s. Taking 1 by 2 outside, 1 by s. Now here can take constant of minus 2. So minus 2 take outside. So L inverse of 1 by s minus 1. And after taking 3 by 2, here L inverse of 1 by s minus 2. Okay, so now direct formula for a inverse Laplace transform. 1 by 2 into L inverse of 1 by s is 1. Minus 2 into L inverse of 1 by s minus 1 is e power, e power t. Plus 3 by 2 into L inverse of 1 by s minus a is e power a t, e power 2 t. So now 1 by 2 into 1. So finally, the solution of the differential equation is 1 by 2 minus 2 into e power t plus 3 by 2 into e power 2t. So this is the solution of the given differential equation.